welcome back to my channel to my channel once again guys i think you guys are doing well now in the situation stay home stay safe as i'm always telling hopefully we shall overcome within few days or maybe few weeks so let's hope for the best and let's jump to the topic today's topic is that how to join merchant navy after doing mechanical engineering see first thing let's keep it in some in little discussion period uh, like suppose many of you guys don't know about merchant navy when you are in class 12 or something like that and you will choose btech engineering or b engineering in mechanical engineering afterwards during your course or and all you came to know or come to know about that merchant navy field or marine engineering then if you must have think that we should have joined that course and all but the way the path is still open for you guys you can join as a marine engineering or marine engineer in merchant navy if you are doing your mechanical engineering also so first finish your mechanical engineering with the 50% marks it must be btech or be in mechanical engineering then only you can join as a marine engineer in merchant navy what you have to do is that first thing you need to clear your btech with 50% marks that's the eligibility criteria then you need to do gme course the gme means graduate in marine engineering that is the full form of gme so duration duration is one year for that course but one thing you need to keep in your mind that you need to select a good college or a proper college which is dgshipping approved you can go to the website dgshipping approved colleges or i'll give you the link and you must search from that that which all colleges are providing this gme course because not each and every college is providing this gme course this marine engineering is common course in marine colleges you will find this course but gme is little out of the box or unorthodox so you need to find that very limited college are providing like i can tell you some names it, it's anglo eastern great eastern and sci also is providing samudra institute also providing so these are colleges and you can find out from internet also as per that you can take admission criteria is very simple pcm 60% you know and that the b take or b part you need to have 50% in the all all semester in aggregate marks you need to have 50% now move to the salary and career path after doing gme you can join as a trainee engineer or junior engineer or fifth engineer in the ship that time you will get a salary around 40 to 50000 maybe less that depends up to the company rough salary i am telling and one thing guys want to tell you that if you haven't seen my video salary in merchant navy you can go to the i button and description box you will find the link you will come to know about all the salaries in all the ranks that will also has been discussed but in the video i'll again discuss about the marine engineer salary so the training part is over and to appear in the examination you need to have minimum 6 months of sea time as a junior engineer or fifth engineer afterwards you need to appear for your meo class 4 examination for the promotion from the mnb so after clearing your examination you can join as a fourth engineer in the ship and that time your salary will rise up to 1.5 lakhs to 2 lakhs again it varies as per company and to promote as a third engineer you don't need to have to have appear in any examination it will be on board promotion depend upon your performance your appraisal report how you are performing in your particular rank as a fourth engineer and the chief engineer will recommend to company that yes this guy's performance is very nice and well and he has learned the third engineer job now he is ready for take charge as a third engineer so company will promote you maybe one contract maybe two contract or maybe three contract that all depends up to you but after getting your coc you need to have 18 months of sea time or sailing time as an engineer for appear for meo class 2 examination what is that that is the examination to promote as a second engineer so 18 months is required as a coc holder to 
eligible for this examination. After clearing your MEA class 2 examination, you can promote as a second engineer. But it doesn't mean that after clearing examination, suddenly or on the next contract, you will promote as a second engineer. It is not like that. Maybe you need to have sale as a third engineer with your MEA class 2 license after monitor you or after good performance chief engineer will recommend you and you will promote as a second engineer after uh, getting your second engineer CUC you need to have again 18 months of C time at C for appearing for the MEU class 1 examination or examination for the chief engineer after clearing your examination you will promote as a chief engineer maybe again I am telling that maybe with the chief engineer license you need to have sale as a second engineer one or two contract extra for learn the chief engineer's job it's not that easy that you have cleared your exam and you will promote as soon as possible not like that you need to perform and you, have, you need to show the your seniors that you are ready for take charge of that position because clearing examination is different thing and take a charge of the post is completely different thing so you need to understand this thing so that is the career path and salary I have told. So I will not discuss any physical requirement at all. If you haven't seen, you can go to the i button and see the physical requirement video and all that you will get. Okay, so another thing I forgot to tell you that age limit. Age limit is your age must be below 28 years. And the college fees will be around 3 to 4 lakhs for one year course. I think all the information has been discussed. Hopefully you have liked the video. If you have liked, please press in the like button to like the video and share the video to all the marine engineering students or the aspirants who are want to join in the marine engineering field who are pursuing in a mechanical engineer to get into it. And please don't forget to subscribe the channel. It will motivate me to make videos for you guys. If people are in home right now, watch my videos, gain some knowledge and afterwards you can decide whatever you want to do in your life and that's it for the day take care goodbye signing off for the day see you in the next video bye